going by Dan. I'm to checking out the haunted all against all. This comes from Spooks. If you guys have any requests, just hit me up. This is a, I, I'm gonna say it again. All against all, that should be a band name. Like the haunted, it's, you know, it's not bad. It's an okay band name. It, it's one of those things that if you type in though, a lot of other things will pop up too, like different movies called the haunted. But all against all, that sounds pretty sweet. They probably should have switched. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. I like that. That'd be a good band name. Let's check this out. Shut up. I'm big on band names, man. <laughs> band names matter. That drum snare is extra snary this time. <laughs> extra snappy. Psycho version of him. I like this. Yeah, I like him with this energy, the manic energy. Like when he's pissed off. Let's 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 talk about it. Let's fight. All against all. Let's go. Here we go. the director for this shot. That was fucking so sweet. Oh, my God. 
Fuck it, just fucking go! Probably didn't end well for that, man. That was awesome. That was awesome. That was like... His vocals kind of sound like the guy from Anthrax. And I've only heard like one or two Anthrax songs. Mainly Safe Home. Fucking great song. But kind of sounds like the very similar rasp. Him and the guy from Anthrax. But the guy from Anthrax with the energy of someone from a... Of Hatebreed. There you go. In this song. Where it's this manic... Let's just kind of just... Punch, let's get drunk and just start swinging at any person that's around. Let's fucking go. <laughs> like, he was, especially the first verse, those were not normal vocal cadences. That is not normally how you sing a bar. He was all over the place, but it fit the, like, the meaning of the song. Sometimes you'd be like, man, I don't know what he's doing. Maybe you're offbeat, kind of. No, that was intentional for the, again, the manic energy, one against all, all against all of this song. Let's fucking go. And also, again, that, that bridge when he screamed, uh, he just wants someone to, that he can trust, wants to find someone he can trust. When he held trust for ages and the camera panned up and they were slowly building momentum to do that, uh, the, the whirlwind mosh, that was excellent. What a good camera shot. That was fucking so sweet. They probably, they probably had to spend a couple hundred bucks to rent a crane to do that. Well worth it, my friend. And also, I saw a guy with long hair Playing a very dangerous game. Going against the grain of a whirlwind mosh. Be careful. Be careful. <laughs> because they won't stop. So if you trip... Just saying. Be very fucking careful. But that was awesome, man. Let's go. And yeah, I'm starting to... Kind of just look... Really forward to their, uh, their bridges. Because they clearly give a shit about the bridges. I love that. I hate when a band... And a lot of bands do it. They'll have a really good song, but then the bridge is kind of half-assed. It's either like a four to six second guitar solo or just really just a transitional drum roll. It's like, damn it! Give me a bridge! Tell me you wrote and took time. You gave a shit. And it went right back into the chorus. Good stuff, man. That was awesome. What'd you guys think down below? The only problem is now I got the, I got the fucking The Flood song stuck in my head. I do. Like, even after hearing this, the Flood's chorus is stuck in my fucking head. <laughs> I hate when that happens. Let me know what you guys think. Down below, if you are still here. Yeah, the Flood's one of those songs that creeps up on you, and it just, it sticks. It sticks. 